Yo, what is going on boys? It is Maze and I'm back with another YouTube video today. I hope you guys are doing good and today I am here with another Road to 1 Million Coins episode. I haven't done one of these in a little bit. It's been a few weeks, maybe even almost a month. I'm not even too sure, so I'm sorry about taking so long to do another one of these episodes, but we are back on this series. I do want to grind it out to get up to 1 mil. So currently, it says we're at 340, but I do have two or three cards up on the auction right now. Um, a couple of them for up for 70k so we do have a lot more coins than really shown we probably have almost close to 500k right now so you know i'm just gonna wait for those cars to sell of course but i do want to snipe out for a little bit see whatever coins we can make and then i do maybe want to mix in maybe you know another try at the re-rolls i might try out the 85 plus overall campus hero re-rolls because those were doing pretty good um, you know, see if we can make some coins off of that and so on and so forth. So we might try it out. So before anything, all we're pretty much going to do is uh, I'm just going to buy some training real quick. I'm going to snipe out some training, see what we can get and then go into it. But before anything does get started, make sure to drop a sub down below on the channel. I really do appreciate it for the best coin making methods and mutt tips in Madden 21. And if you enjoy this series, you'll be able to get more episodes in the future. And if you haven't already watched the first 10 episodes, make sure to go to watch those first. In this series, we pretty much just showcase all the best coin making methods that I try my best to make some coins off of and I'm gonna try to get up to a mil in this account we're pretty much halfway there so you know we got more methods to try out and let's also try and hit at least 20 likes on this video I appreciate it so what we're gonna do is going to go to 92 to 93 we're gonna go down to the program free agency and then we're just gonna go uh, quarterback and um, right end. that's pretty much the best way to get the training in this right now so we're gonna try and get these. I mean, maybe less than uh, 75K might be the move right now, but I wanna get them for less than 70K, that would be good. But it seems as if their price has gone up a little bit. So I'm just gonna put W in the search bar real quick. So I'm pretty sure they're probably a little bit less uh, useful right now. I'm gonna see if I can maybe get this Malik Hooker. That would be pretty good. And uh, we do get that Malik Hooker. So the Malik Hooker, I mean, for 50K is really good for a 92. So I wanted to try that, but we at least got the Malik Hooker. We'll use that for some training. I'll buy, I'll try and get this James Winston as well. And we don't end up getting that, but I'm going to sit here and refresh on this filter. See if we can maybe get some 93 snipes and uh, quick sell them and try out this little campus hero method. There's one up for 66,000 coins and we end up getting that James Winston. So awesome. We got that one. I think I'm just going to try and get one more James Winston so we have the 92 and then two of the 93s. We're not going to try a ton of training right now just because I do want to keep some coins in this account. But if we don't end up making coins off of these campus hero rerolls, I might buy one more 93 and keep trying. We'll see what happens. But, uh, you know, I mean, the heavyweight ones did work very well. There's one up for 69K and we don't get that one. But we're going to continue on after that. But either way, there is some more, you know, I mean, we might try the heavyweight rerolls. I know those did really good for me in that video when I showed it to you. But I know that the campus hero ones, you can really make a lot of coins off of those as well. Um, so we're going to try the one. One up for 70K. We're going to really hope we can get it. And we finally do. Thank God. So we do. Oh, there was another one up for 70. I probably was going to miss that either way. So let's quick sell these real quick for some training. Hopefully we can make some coins. So we should be at about maybe... 38,000 training or so like that there are two limiteds in packs right now so it kind of makes me want to roll training varieties i really don't know if that's a good idea honestly i really doubt that it is a good idea but i kind of want to try it out i'm not too sure i mean maybe for the episode we do still have two 90s up so let's try and roll some of these training varieties see if we can pull in ltd i was going to do the campus reroll or the um you know i was going to maybe try the heavyweights but let's try these training varieties just to see if we can pull some stuff. I might go and buy another 93 just so we can quick sell some more training. See what we can end up getting. But let's really hope, you know, if we can pull an LTD, that'll make this episode actually insane. It'll help us out so much. Um, you know, I really doubt we're actually going to. But like I said, I mean, there's, there's, no, there's no hurt in trying. So we're getting decent power-ups right now. But I just want to get at least, you know, I mean, at least something good like a 92 of some sort or pretty much anything like that and 85 Deion Sanders that doesn't do too much for us remember we spent about I mean I think I'm pretty sure we spent about uh, a little less than 200k as we get a 96 overall Dak Prescott oh wow I we got a green redux I didn't even realize at first that is crazy dude that is crazy a 96 overall Dak Prescott wow <laughs> Dog, that just made the whole episode that probably just paid for most of it. Let's go, dude. A 96 Dak Prescott. 
I don't know how much that goes for. I know he has the 98. I really do not know how much that goes for, but I really hope it goes for something. That is actually insane. We just got a 96 overall. It's not even an LTD, but we'll take it, man. I'll, <laughs> we'll, we'll keep going. Let's see what else we can pull. We get an 87 overall Aaron Donald right there. Nothing amazing, but you know, we'll take what we can get. That is actually crazy. I don't know. And we get 50,000 coins. Wow, dude, we get 50K. That pays for a whole 92 overall. So we pretty much spent 140K and we got the 96 DAC. This stuff is already paid for right now. So, you know, pretty much anything after this is just profit. And we still have 10 more of these packs to open up. That is actually crazy. I might open some gaps after this as well, just see what we get. And just so I can, you know, extend the episode a little bit. Um, but that is really insane, dude. Let's go. That was crazy, man. That was crazy. I know I didn't even realize I pulled it until I looked back. I was like, yo. Oh, man. That was awesome, dude. All right. Well, like I said before, we're still going to continue to roll these. See what we can get. We have 15,000 training left to roll. You know, let's really hope for the best, man. Let's really hope for the best. As we get another uniform, anything after this is really profit. I could keep it, but I do want to keep rolling. So I'm just going to keep, you know, quick selling anything back for the most part. That isn't too crazy. Most of these uniforms and stuff, I'll probably just quick sell back. There's no point to really go back and sell them. So we get a power up. We have about five of these packs remaining if we don't get anything that we can quick sell. So hopefully, all right, well, as we get a uniform, so I'm going to go and quick sell that. And we still have five left to go. So let's see what's up. Get a quick 5K quick sell right there. We pretty much still have about three packs remaining if we don't get anything that we can quick sell. So, you know, as we're getting a power up, I doubt I'm going to go quick sell. So two more packs remaining. Hopefully, maybe we can, you know, clutch out a limited time in the last. Okay, so we're getting a power up here. One last pack. One last pack. And we get an LTD and 98 overall. Ryan Kelly right here. And we get a uniform that I'm going to go quick sell. So we still have one more pack. We're going to go back into it. What do we get? And we get 2K. All right. So let's go back. And we see Dak Prescott is selling for 400,000 coins, dude. 400,000 coins. Wow, man. We just got super lucky with that one. Let me post up this deck for 400K. If we can maybe get like a couple thousand training. So we get 700. All right. So we got two more of those packs. I know I get usually very addicted to these packs when, when you know, I, uh, when I start opening them, but we're going to just keep going at it. I mean, these packs obviously have been doing us well. We get an 86 Stefan Gilmore. Let's quick sell that back. And, uh, you know, we'll see what we can get in this last pack. There's one more and we end up getting 2000 coin quick sell. So we still have 1500. I mean, I'll probably just end up leaving it at that at this point. I don't really know what else. Um, let's see what we have on our auction block real quick, just to see how many coins we're going to end up having. So on the auction block right now, we have about 428,000 coins after tax. I'm going to add that on to the total we already have, and we will be up to 708,000 coins after these things sell so we literally just made about 200k in like two seconds that we literally just made it in like two seconds with that lucky Dak prescott pull that was huge for us so now we are this much closer to 1 million coins in just one episode we made up to 200,000 coins that is actually crazy i can't believe it um i don't know if i should just stop the episode here i mean that seems like that seems as if we did a lot I'm going to see if maybe I can snipe out a few of those uh, free agent cards just to put the icing on the cake because it seemed as if they were getting posted for pretty cheap. So the Dak Prescott just sold. I just wanted to let you guys know before anything, the Dak Prescott just sold. So we're at 642,000 coins waiting for that last 92 overall to sell. And I'm just going through this filter for a little bit. I'll probably go through it for like five minutes or so. If I find any cool snipes, I'll buy them out. But if I can't, then, you know, we'll just call it a video after that. It doesn't really seem as if that I'm having much luck with this filter as I was before. I thought we were gonna maybe be able to get some decent snipes, but uh, you know, the volume just isn't really there right now, unfortunately, but that's all good. At least I know that we tried. No matter what, we still made a little bit over 200K in this whole entire video. So I'm not mad at all, honestly. Uh, you know, we had a pretty good a pretty good go about in this video as there is a couple up for 70k But I mean not really a too good of a snipe right now um, So not bad, but uh, I appreciate you guys watching no matter what hopefully you guys enjoyed I know it probably wasn't you know as long as a video that they usually are when it comes to this series But we made a lot of coins and we did a little bit of a pack opening while we did it So that was pretty fun. Um, I was gonna open up some get it players as well, too But I just think we already made so many coins that it doesn't even really matter at this point We'll just you know continue that on in another episode 
But uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. I appreciate it. And last thing, I do want to give a shout out again to the legend members. I did say that I'm going to be doing shout outs in certain videos, but I do again want to thank NonJHD, MTF Starboy, and Eli. Thank you guys so much for being legend members. And anyone else that has become a member already in the community, I will have the perks and rewards out for you guys soon. And um, I'm going to try my best to stream tonight, but I might not be able to, but I should be able to drop two videos tonight. So hopefully you guys have a lookout for that. But I appreciate you guys watching it. Thank you guys so much. Hope you guys have a good one and peace.